escape the police. Uh, so it's up here first. Might get a gun or something. Looks like we have to continue out that little side gate, anyways. Is that the gas station? Looks like it. Or at least looks like it has the same layout as the gas station. Yeah, doesn't seem to be anything really interesting here. Susie. Wheeler's drunk or hopped up on something. Speaking of which, that fed had a pretty distinctive whiff of old scotch about him, if you know <laughs> what I mean. Oh, he was drunk. Over. Uh, I don't have anything on that, Deputy Mulligan. Over. Well, whatever. Anyway, Rose is just being plain weird here. You better get Doc in to take a look at both. Over. Gotcha. You better get them here quickly. The uh, fed's gonna want to interview Wheeler. Over. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'll bet he does. Looks like they have a lot in common. All we can out. What, the drinking? I could see the lights at the radio station in the distance. Going there. I imagine that the broadcast tower in the distance was part of the local radio station. Maine seemed like a decent guy. Perhaps he could give me directions to the coal mine. Too decent of a guy. That's Unnatural that shadows clung to the gate. The darkness that was after me was trying to stop me. I wouldn't get through without a light. Yeah, light, buddy. This big spotlight here. How convenient. It's over here. Power it on. And now we have to move it onto the gate. And get this thermos. The old generator conked out. Not I'd have to see if I could fix it and try again. A little bit of time. Where do they put collectibles then? <laughs> Let's see if I can fix it. Kick. Nailed it. served its purpose, that's okay. Hmm. Who's 
accident. Oh. Oh, what happened? Am I supposed to see something? Just the gates being creepy? Pick up flashlight. Be back, baby. Eventually, we'll find a revolver, too. Be to our revolver is police chasing. Screaming doors, not like you haven't seen one before. I mean, they just showed us one before this. It took me a oh, moment shit. to recognize the flashbang grenades. They were an ideal weapon for my situation. A flashbang? One, come in. Over. Tutorial us with like a couple enemies to throw these at, probably. Holy oh, shit. The police. Boom. Damn. Take a second to go off. All oh, the police are evil now, Chen. Well, continue to be evil. Let's go, shotgun. Do they just die if I light them? Or do I have to flash them? Does I have to flash them? Flashbanks of this. Oh, they just give you more, I see. And here's another call. You're on KBFFM with Pat Main. It's Milt Peabody, Pat. What's on your mind, Milt? Well, I live near the trailer park, Pat, and there's a big ruckus going on over there. Well, that's just up the road from me, too. Uh, what's going on, do you know? I don't know, but there's a bunch of police cars there, lots of sirens, a uh, helicopter Boy, around. What it do? Gunshots. gunshots. Yes, sir. Like from a pistol. So can you find out what's going on? Cause it's just next door, and they're popping off guns there. They're still shooting? No, it was maybe 10, 15 minutes ago. It sounds serious, Pat. I'm telling you, it don't sound like no party. Well, I'm, I'm certainly gonna give the station a call, Milt. Okay. You'll hear it here as soon as I hear from them. Okay. Thanks. That page over there. And a bunch of enemies, I assume. Okay. You are under arrest. <laughs> like I didn't die. Touched by the dark presence. Rose was lost in a dreamland where everything was drawn in black and gray crayons. The old lady had promised her that all her wishes would come true. She would be Alan Wake's muse. She was smiling so hard it hurt her face. She crushed a bottle full of sleeping pills into the coffee. Deep down inside, she was screaming in terror. Yeah. What's the wizard of the gun? Oh, well, it's a wizard and he's holding a gun. We call him... Alan Wake. We only have five fat, uh, flashbangs. Which wave takes two? According to my calculations, we're fucked. There we go. I 
got two now. Lighting in this game is cool. Is cool. There we go again. Gotta round them up and get them all down in one go. That'd be really nice. Stuck on a twig. Nice. Nice boots. Where am I supposed to go? Check this out, this police car. Ah, yes, a seizure. I knew it. Oh! Play some more flares, because we're almost out. Oh, nice. There are some. I was literally about to joke that, oh, nice, there's nothing here, but there are actually flares. So. Wait, this is the way to go. I mean, it's back at this mine area. Oh, no, dude, come on. The spawns are weird. Like, we just fought there, and I can't help but feel like... They're, like, not checkpointed, but timer? No, that wouldn't make sense even though it's, like, ten seconds apart. Supplies. Walk in light. Oops. What I get? Ooh, flare gun and flares. Uh, I mean, these are all like AOE hey, use. Trust no one in the dark. Chad, are you guys in the light or in the dark right now? Do I trust you? How'd you like Lords of the Fallen? Yeah, we did finish it. Full playthroughs on YouTube. Actually, it's missing seven episodes, but those will be uploaded tomorrow morning. And then all 73 will be up there. Uh, I liked it. 75% in the end. It certainly had its problems, but I had fun with it overall, for sure. Well, we did one of three endings, but yeah, it was pretty... I mean, the ending itself was whatever. Fuck me, that boss fight was maybe the worst Souls boss I've ever done in my life. I can even call it a boss. Almost at the radio station chat. Radio sh sh Radio Shack? What the fuck? Could lend me a car to get to the coal mine. There he is. I was wondering if he could see him through the windows. Well, I just don't see why the cops bother with the trailer park. What do you mean? Hello. Yes, I did love the sloot rolling in it. It's like we're maybe gonna go out that way. Thank you very much for that uh, compassionate viewpoint, Lorna. How can I show? Oh, here's a little surprise. The famous writer Alan Wake just walked in. Folks, I'm going to see if I can talk him into an interview. Come on in, Mr. Wake. Oh, I'm so glad you could find the time to do this, Mr. Wake. Oh, shit, dude. Nowhere to run now, Dan Brown. You back away from me. Don't hurt. 
are you whoa, talking whoa, about? Whoa. Everyone calm down. Put the gun down. We're all friends here, right? Cool your jets, Nightingale. We got him. Judas Priest! What the hell's the matter with you? There's a civilian in there. What is it? This guy's got worse temper than we do. Slow mo. Oh, we we didn't slide very far. I'll get you yet, even if it kills me. You hear me? You hear me, HP Lovecraft? Why? I had fallen off so many cliffs, it was ridiculous. <laughs> was That's caught. what you get for naming a book the sudden stop. It was probably good I hadn't had the chance to tell Maine where I was going. I'd have to lose the cops and find my own way to the. Is that mine. Woody Allen? It did look like him actually true. Reach the train depot. We have one flashbang. The thing is, in, in terms of things that, oh, in terms of things that can actually kill, we only have three ammo left. Nightingale stared through the broken studio window into the dark woods. He turned around, started to walk out, but Maine grabbed his arm. Young man, you almost shot me. You don't shoot off rounds at people like that. What's the matter with you? Nightingale shook his arm free, marched out. His cheeks burned with rage and humiliation. Was he washed up? Yeah, one sec. Josh messaged me. Actually, I should probably see what time he wants to start tonight. Should be good to go by 5 p.m. his time. That's in an hour and a half. Okay, we got about an hour and a half of this today, chat, and then we finish tomorrow before we play with Josh today, that is. Cool. Did you do tutorial? Actually, maybe a bit more because he's going to have to do the tutorial for the game, which we did already. Yes, Skibby. Skibbity doopa, skibbity dee. Oi, Grizzly. I mean, we aren't, we aren't gonna finish this game in one setting, anyways. So we'll, we'll go play with Wizard with a Gun Co op with Josh, because that game was super fun for the brief period we played it. Uh, three of them? Three of them. My last uh, flashbang. Hopefully, get a revolver or something here. What is this? Another flare? I have to play survival mode now. I mean, do I really want to use my flare gun? We could, technically. With two of those. Count as dying for them if I just like go hide in the light. Maybe not. That's all for like defeating them. They have sickles. Let's check what's up here. Hopefully some more uh, ammo or loot or something. I think they're making the next game 
a little more actiony or is it an evil style right i mean it's already pretty actiony but I'm focusing it a bit a bit more right? well at least i don't know they're spacing out off of the trailer they had worth coming up here because we've set to burn six bullets for that. This place is crawling with enemies. Wait, is this the way we came down? No. Or is it? I don't think it is. Is this the way we came down? I don't know. Not worth whatever it is by the looks of it. <clears throat> yeah, we're pretty down bad for ammo. Three bullets. I don't know if we light a flare close enough when they're there that it'll kill them. There's not going to be more enemies here either. At least two of them. There's an old shack here. There was no sensible reason for the power Watch company back. work lights to be here. It was almost as if they'd been left for someone like me to use. What in check? Shotgun. Well, shit, brother. Wait, why did you just walk through the light? shit is that? Oh, this is a chonky voice. Ow. stuck there. Two more guys. through a lot of ammo again. The darkness controls the taken. What the hell is that? What? Revolver ammo, nice. Battery not so useful. Yeah the uh the flashlight mechanic is pretty easy to kind of not really cheese, but you know, like get a lot out of. That's the way we have to go. But I think there's a page up here by the looks of it, which is probably gonna be surrounded by enemies. But it is what it is. Wizard with a gun. Later, I'm confused what that is. Chat. The, the game is literally called Wizard with a Gun. It came out like two days ago, two three days ago. <laughs> the bulldozer's engine roared to life. Mud and rocks flew as it fought for traction. It crashed through the concrete wall and landed heavily in the yard. If it were an animal, it would have shaken its head after the impact, fixed its eyes on me, and charged. Of course, it had no head, nor eyes. Shadows crawled on its form, twisting it into a monster. Then, it came for me.
What game are you playing that has a wizard and a gun? Well, you see, the game's called Wizard with a Gun. I'm actually banging out every game. Did you meant to say gun or come there? Or you said cund. That's where we just fought. I don't really care about the collectibles so much. I'd rather have some ammo. But it is what it is, champ. The atmosphere in the game is very nice. This game it's cool. It's a creepy forest, fog, windy vibe. Sarah trusted her gut, and her gut said Agent Nightingale was an asshole. He felt wrong. And it wasn't just the smell of stale booze. It was in the way he flashed his badge, pulled rank, the look in his eyes when he wanted answers. Where was Alan Wake? What was this about an accident? Where was his wife? And most importantly, why did she let Wake go? He wouldn't answer her questions. Federal business was all he'd say. I feel this guy's uh, a little off the record, so to speak. Doesn't seem right. Shotgun ammo, revolver ammo, which we have nine shells. Okay. We have one flare left for a uh, Barry. Is that you? Wait, where is Hello? Barry? All right, he's still passed out. The most out. stubborn man I've ever met. Oh shit. Alice, Alice. Alan, Alan. I'm so afraid. It keeps me in the dark. Please help me. I look at you. And it's not you. It's something else. Looking out from behind your eyes. Alice, I'm here. I'm so alone here. It's all gonna go to hell. You need to be careful. Cooperate. Okay. The connection had been terrible, but that wasn't the only thing that hadn't been right with the oh, call. Shit. She sounded wrong somehow, but she had called me. Some loot up that way. The pipe wrenched itself loose from the bridge's steel framework. Wrapped in darkness, it floated in midair, twitching. For a moment, I didn't understand what I was looking at. The heavy object lurched at me with impossible force. I threw myself out of the way, but just barely. When I turned my flashlight on it, it shook in a dark rage before it flew at me again. Surprised I haven't seen more Chainsaw Man. Men. Ooh, capped on ammo. Revolver ammo. Damn, we haven't even looked in the box yet. We got so much ammo. Oh, hell yeah, brother. They stuck their up good. Holy shit. It was a tarp. Kind of. Positive of supplies now. Holy static, man. I mean, we're in the middle of the woods. How good did you expect the connection to be? I could see a railway bridge up ahead and a warehouse of some sort on the opposite shore. I hoped I could find a car from there. Like a reasonable assumption. 